using the ACM200, configuration of your multicast system has never been easier. With all of your transmitters and receivers connected to the switch, all you have to do is click Start Scan. The wizard will now do the rest of the work, configurating all of the units and adding them to your system. Now that everything's been found, we can stop the scan. What's left to do now is finish configurating the transmitters and the receivers. Here we can manage the names and the EDIDs of the transmitters, and if you need to identify one, just use the view button. Now enter the names of your receivers and select the scaled output if required. Once you've finished naming everything, managing your EDIDs and scalers, you're essentially finished. You can choose to set up a video wall or manage your fixed routing, but we're going to move on to the drag and drop control. Drag and drop control is here to work alongside your third party control system of choice. It's just a visually simple way of controlling your system. You just drag and drop the transmitter to the receiver you want to view it on. In conjunction with the user accounts, this becomes a very powerful tool that can also be used on any device that has a browser connected to the same network. You can also now use drag and drop to switch sources across your video wall. On the routing page, you can manage the distribution of video, audio, IR and serial all independently and supported by the multicast UHD IP 200 TX and RX, USB and CEC. Managing users and their permissions couldn't be easier. Just click new user, give them a username and password and they are ready to go. You can also manage their permissions. Just remember to delete the guest account, otherwise everyone will have access to everything by default. Now when you log out and use the new account, you only have access to the transmitters and the receivers that you've given permission to. You can also quickly and easily update the password for the admin account. Managing and adding to your multicast system couldn't be easier. Through the projects page, you can easily export a project, import a project, scan once to add new units that you've added, or scan continually to add units one by one to the system as you plug them in. You can also go to the transmitter page and easily and quickly update the name of a transmitter. You can also manage finer points of the transmitters, reboot them, change serial settings, things like that. From the receiver page, you can do much like you can with the transmitters. Update the name of the receiver, manage finer points of the system, serial settings, check the video preview and screen rotations. Thank you ever so much for watching. We will be showcasing the ACM200 at ISE 2019 and we look forward to seeing you there.